Hey, I'm Dan, and this is Dan's Planes. So here I am in the middle of my something extra update um, build log, and I got to a point where I'm building the battery tray and need to um, cut this line. And usually I would do that with my small um, Harbor Freight table saw here, but I've never really been happy with that table saw. I don't think it's all that accurate and kind of moves around. You have to kind of be careful with it. And so I had totally forgotten. I got a Christmas present this year and I didn't do an unboxing of it. So here's the box that it came in. This is a Micromark table saw. Witness all the glory as the clouds part and the angels sing. Micro mark table saw. So this gives me a reason to bust this guy out. Give it a try. Oh, well, look at that. They've got a little spot for the cord to fit into when it's being stored. How cool is that? Okay, the blade's already installed. I wasn't sure if it would be or not. That is cool. And all the accoutrements. A couple table clamps. And a guide. Um, screws. Okay, there are three um, wood screws, not four, three, to, I guess, mount this down. Okay, yes, we've got a hole there and a hole there to put these long screws into if you want to screw it down. Where would the third one? The third one was much shorter. Huh, whoops. Um, the third one is, uh, is much shorter, so I'm not sure where that goes yet. So, get to break this out and read the destructions and give this guy a try. See if I can't get this piece of wood cut. All right, that is all. Okay, here we go. We're gonna give it a shot. Note to self, turn the volume down at this part. There you have it. Nice straight ripped cut. <coughs> and wood dust. <coughs> Excellent. One out of one, Dan's agree that this was a was a good gift for Christmas for sure. I could see this getting a lot of use. Now, it did not fit to my Harbor Freight small shop vac, um, so I have this other handy little thing here that came with one of my, I think, maybe hand sander or something. 
Um, well, good. Looks like it caught all the dust in there. So that'll work. There we go. Now we'll pack her and put her away. Thanks so much for watching. I'm Dan from Dan's Planes. I just want to share some content about RC planes, something I've been passionate about since childhood. I'm hoping I can teach something to someone. I can start some discussion and learn some things from others. So let's just have some fun and learn some things together. If you enjoyed what you watched, it would really help me out if you could like, subscribe, and share. And if you feel that it helped you out in some way, or it might help future viewers, I'd really appreciate it if you'd visit my Patreon page and become a patron. It's like throwing a dollar tip into a guitar case when you pass by. It helps to, to fund future content and future projects that I'll be working on. I plan to show some past content. I have some other flights and I have some fly-in events that I've been to. And I also plan to show future flights and future repairs, as well as building ARFs and, if I can ever get back to it, building my top flight uh, Spitfire. So there's a lot of content to come, but it's, it's viewers like you that are able to support what I'm doing. And by doing that, I'm able to spend more time creating that content in the future. So I'd really appreciate it. But either way, thanks for watching and thanks for any support. And I wish you blue skies and good speed.